what is up guys, Milak here, and today we are back in action playing some ARK, and it's gonna be freaking amazing. If you guys actually enjoyed the video, make sure to smash the like button. I actually had a, co a comment yesterday, or not yesterday, last video, that said, uh, stop begging for likes. Uh, I don't actually beg for likes. If you notice, I say, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to smash the like button. So I'm just reminding you guys that if you actually, if you did enjoy it, feel free to dislike. I don't, but I'm just saying if you actually liked the video, remember to like the, like it. So yeah. Uh, and uh, you hurt my feelings that you don't pay attention. So please, pay pay attention. If you're going to criticize someone, pay attention. <laughs> Anyways, uh, what we're going to do today is, uh, we're, first of all, we're going to name Paracetherium. I just now looked in through the comments here. And uh, we got a couple good names. So people seem to like uh, like Facility. Facility got six upvotes. And also Empire got a, a few upvotes as well. Uh, I like both of those. I like Empire, I think. But I think we're going to name this guy Facility. Let's see. Facility. Yes, there we go. Awesome. Okay, so this guy's named Facility. Uh, wreckage is actually on top of him. Is that all we tamed last time was uh, this dude? Now, some of you guys actually said I should tame uh, the Dung Beetle like I, I was going to last time. But you also said I should tame the Alpha Dilo. Apparently, the Alpha Dilo does a lot. Is this guy still on? Yeah, this guy's still on. Apparently, the Alpha Dilo actually does a lot. Ooh, is this large? Not small. Medium. Wait, do we have no large feces? Wait, 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 wait. So does this mean we can't tame a dung beetle if we don't have any large feces? Hmm, I wish we could, like, combine it together. Like, take our hands and, like, mush it together or something. <laughs> that sounds a little gross, though. Um, so, I don't know. We can try with the medium. Also, I guess we're going to look for a alpha dilo today as well. Uh, do we have... I'm going to put everything up. So what we're going to do is I'm going to pause it here. I'm probably going to take the bird out. We're going to go through the swamp and look for more dung beetles and also alpha dilos. And then try to tame them. I was also thinking maybe, since I have a bunch of narcotics. See, I have a lot of narcotic, uh, I think, in one of these dudes here. I have it somewhere. I'm not exactly sure where it's at. We have like over a thousand narcotic. Uh, but we could also try making some... Trank arrows, possibly. So that that could be a thing. Oh, by the way, I found uh, the narcotic here. So we have like 900 narcotic in here. Uh, and I was looking through the extinction patch notes. And apparently, apparently there's like, um, yeah, let's go ahead and get on this guy. Uh, he's added, Psycho's added alpha therizina sources. So I don't know if uh, the new creatures spawn on the volcano. Uh, someone said they did, but I'm not sure if that's true or not. But I would really love to get an Alpha Theory. I think that would be pretty sick. Theories are absolutely amazing. Uh, and an Alpha Theory is probably going to do a lot of damage. So they're, they're going to be pretty good for damage and gathering. Uh, let's go ahead. Which one is my swamp again? I can't exactly remember. That's berries. Uh, that's desert. Okay, that's... that's No, actually. Yeah, that, yeah, berries. It's berries. I forgot. I was like, I was looking specifically for swamp. But I guess, yeah, it's the berries one. Okay, so I don't know how long it's going to take. I'm going to try to find a decently high level dung beetle. I also grabbed the poop. Uh, so we're gonna try medium and animal feces. I'm not sure if medium works if it needs large then I guess I'm SOL We're just gonna have to tame some creatures. I thought I figured at least the Paracetherium would put poop, uh, poop out large feces, right? Also, what's with the server right now? What's happening with the server? I don't understand Why am I what what the heck is going on? Why am I just going back? That's so weird. Oh, guys, look at this. So we've actually found an Alpha Dilo here. Pretty fast, actually. Uh, he's level 84. I just now looked up what they need to tame, and they need copy eggs. So, so uh, we actually do have plenty of copy eggs, so that's good. We had it on us. Um, also, I love how in Extinction, the kibble lasts for a long time, which I think it should because kibble's kind of like... The way I imagine kibbles, it's kind of like dog food. So it'll last a while, and except for the kibbles made specifically for, like, I guess special <laughs> creatures or something i don't know so it's like dog food for individual creatures anyways uh we got the copy egg so that's good uh let's see if we can knock this dude out now i think it said he has around eight thousand torpor so we should be able to do or uh yeah eight thousand so we should be able to do this decently easy i'm not sure though so i'm assuming he can shoot okay uh we got that guy after us maybe we should park the bird up here maybe we should park the bird up here is he gonna land oh yeah he actually lands right here okay and is he gonna shoot me that's really the next question is if he is if he's gonna shoot me oh yeah wait wait let's uh okay oh uh, or or you can drag i can drag him that works as well uh I, <laughs> I didn't actually expect here let's park the bird right here i didn't expect me to drag the bird to me or whatever uh let's 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 get right there okay then let's drag ourselves up here that was totally unexpected okay let's let's jump bounce jump okay or not yeah that's fine that's fine that's fine as well uh let's bounce jump up here boom okay yes land perfect let's stick you on passive okay and then let us shoot the alpha where's okay there he is let's uh what's up man okay so we've shot him please don't shoot me 
Please don't. Sh oh yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so, so does he really not have a ranged attack? That's so weird that he doesn't have a ranged attack. I figured he'd have his like little. Okay, yeah, yeah. What's up? Come back here, man. Come back here, man. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, yep. Okay, you. Oh, dude, right in the face, man. Right in the cranium. Uh, let's. Okay, no, that's fine. You know, that's fine. We don't have to hit every single time. It's perfectly all right. I, I wish you, I, you need, okay, you need to stop moving around. I'm not sure if you're going to go, you're juking me. You, you're going left and right. I need you to go, yes, okay, yeah, go on this side. That's perfectly fine. Um, except for now, I can't see where you're going, man. Okay. Oh, or I could hit the rock. That's perfectly all right as well. I love hitting the rock. Uh, oh, my God, guys. Oh, my God, please, just stop, stop, stop moving. See, did I not hit you right there? I thought I hit you. Uh, okay, let's, you know, or you could keep moving. That's perfectly all right. I don't care if you move or not. Are you back down to zero torpor? No, you're actually, no, that's, that's something else. What are you? Oh, you're actually like halfway. Okay, so maybe I, here, let's, uh, here, you know what we're gonna do? Wait, wait, wait. Oh, he's fighting the spider. He's fighting the spider. Let's, uh, oh no, there's, uh, there's, there's things over here. Come here, man. Okay, we shot him in the face. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. No, no, no. What's he? Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Okay, no, 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 I don't know why they're doing, oh, he's down, he's down, he's down, okay, um, oh, and I'm down, no, 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 okay, he's only doing one damage, that's good, no, 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 go down faster, go down faster, stop it, he's gonna break my armor, please, for the love of God, no, don't do this, no, don't do this, Huh, okay, okay, well, let's go ahead. I'm gonna use a bunch of torpor. Um, half my armor's freaking broken, which is good. I gotta sneeze. Oh my god. Okay, I just sneezed. Okay, so, copy. Eat. Okay! One copy egg. That's perfect. 125. You're perfect. Good job. Good, good boy. Good boy. Okay, let's ride him. So he has a left click, and then do you have a right click? Yeah, you have a right click, and then do you have a C? I don't know if you have a C. Let's, let's go ahead and look at the right click here. So that guy looks pretty cool. I wonder if his normal attacks. Okay, let's, uh, how much damage do you? 33, okay. I wonder, okay, do your normal attacks do torpor? Let's wait until, okay, yeah, yeah. Let's, uh, now let's check to see if we bring you back up to max torpor here. So he might be a pure torpor beast. Yeah, okay, so he, his normal attack actually does torpor, which is pretty cool. Uh, maybe we should see how much per bite? Pop. Oh god, no, 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 no. No, no. Uh, maybe we should take Ho O back. Yeah, let me let me take. Oh, fuck. Okay, so I don't think it really does that much torpor per bite, but we can go ahead and check. Let's just bite the snake here, and then we'll see exactly how much it does per bite. He does. I think he does around seventy or eighty per bite, which isn't that great to be honest. Uh, but I'm assuming as we increase his melee damage, it's probably going to go up, right? So let's. Uh, he actually gets quite a bit of. How much health do you get? Okay, not that much health. So, melee damage, I'm assuming you probably get a lot of movement speed as well, so maybe we'll make this guy fast and try to, like, dodge creatures, possibly? I don't know. Um, let's just see, let's let's try to level up a few more times here. And, uh, we'll see if, oh, look, there's a guy over here. Um, is this guy worth fighting, though? Oh, he's gonna knock me out, isn't he? Nope, nope, not gonna do that. Nope, not gonna do that. <laughs> he's gonna knock me out, and how much torpor do I have? I have eight, okay, 18,000. He actually is not gonna knock me out that fast, but he might, not, might knock me off of my dude by knocking me out. Now, getting around on this dude isn't quite as convenient as the bird, obviously. He's not quite as fast. Is this an apex or anything? Um, let's, here, oh. Oh, oh yeah, this, okay, he's dead. Okay, yeah, he's dead. Uh, Fiomia, wait, was this, uh, is this large? Please be large. No, it's medium, okay, that's fine. Stop it. Stop it. What are you doing? Stop it. Uh, so yeah, anyways, we're gonna continue running around. I'm gonna try to level this dude up, and I'm assuming melee damage translates into torpor. So hopefully he just does more torpor damage than he does melee damage. So far he does, so I'm not sure. Okay, guys, so I tested out increasing the damage, and also tested out his right click. His right click doesn't, it's not like a thing that you aim. It like does it directly in front of you at a very short range, so it's kind of like a like a shotgun burst kind of, and it doesn't really do that much torpor. It just does a, like a torpor over time effect. It does less than a normal bite does. Anyways, I've been is it wait 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 wait. I just saw I just saw trees disappear. Is there an invisible thing over there? I don't know I don't know if there's an invisible thing, but anyways, let's kill this spider right here. What's up, spider? Yeah, I need you to die, man. Okay, you're dead. Uh, you give me all your spoiled meat. 
Okay, so let's go ahead and kill this snake as well. I want to see if medium, if you can actually tame these dung beetles with medium. Dude, he, 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 uh, he attacks so fast, though. That's one good thing about the Dilo here, is he attacks really, really fast. Let's kill these guys. Yep, time for you guys to die. Okay, so, uh, d snakes! Oh my god, I just need these dudes to get out of the way so I can attack, do the things and the stuff with the things. Okay, you're dead. Perfect. Okay, so where's the dung beetle at? There he is. Okay. So, let's just go ahead and use... I don't know if we need bug repellent, but we're just going to use that guy. And then let's try to feed him uh, medium animal feces, okay? If we can feed him medium animal species, uh, feces, then that's going to be great. Yes, we can. Okay. So, I don't know if I want to tame this guy, or we maybe we should try to find a higher one. I just wanted to see if the medium animal feces would actually work. So, let's go around and try to find a higher one. I'm not sure if higher level actually matters since they all have around the same health, but maybe once they're actually tamed, it does matter. Uh, so we got a dung beetle here. He's partially under the ground, though. He just got super angry because I attacked him, but uh, he's he's not angry anymore. Anyways, I don't know why he's under the ground. It seems very strange. Uh, he's been walking around here for a while now. Anyways, uh, let's go ahead and see if we can tame this guy. Hopefully nothing attacks us in it. Oh, you know, that's, that's a snake. You know, I mean... Uh, <laughs> a titan bow is no big deal right no big deal let's just go ahead and murder this dude real quick i hope i really hope that uh since uh I, it says large feces right or large stuff so maybe that's just what he prefers but he eats all of it right i don't know anyways hopefully this still does decent amount of taming let's go ahead and come up behind him let's uh let's okay yeah we got him oh that gave him about 50 percent. he's level 64 too so he's gonna be close to level 100 this is gonna be good man this is gonna be really good perfect so yeah these guys aren't that bad to tame at all uh, he is 51%, so yeah, one more would be perfect. 37,000 health, 23,000 torpor. Of course, you can't knock these dudes out. We already tested that, right? Um, well, I'm not sure if we tested it on camera, but I tested it anyways. Uh, I just hope they're really cool once they actually are tamed here. Oh, there we go. Okay, that was super easy. That was super easy. Uh, let's ride him. Oh, dude, okay, can you jump? I don't know if he can jump, but uh, let's check him out. So he has 10,000 health once he's tamed, 190% uh, melee damage. Let's check out his... Wait, wait. We can turn fecal matter into oil and compound a post, but only when wandering. Actually, let's go ahead and give him all the fecal matter, or is he going to eat it? Is he going to eat it? Or... I don't know if he's going to eat it or not. Uh, let's... So, we got a left attack, which is that. Dude, he attacks extremely fast, and he can attack while walking, too. That's really cool. Oh, dude, he does a lot of damage. Holy crap, he's like a little tank. And when he's sprinting... Oh, no, I thought he directly ran, ran through stuff. Okay, let's see if we can actually get him up on land again. Or is this is it just something to do with this spot right here? Okay, no, he just doesn't like... He does he likes being in the snow. So, right, cla right click shoots that. I wonder if you can partially aim it. No, it looks like it goes in the same spot every single time. Looks like you can po possibly aim it down. Yeah, you can aim it down, actually. That's so weird, though. And then let's see about C. So, C summons beetles. That is so good. That is so good. And I wonder if he has any... you have any other special attacks? No, we just got a bunch of beetles, man. Awesome. Well, I'm going to take the Dilo back to base, and uh, we're going to play around with this dude. I don't know. Does this... Did we get knocked out by this guy before? I can't remember if this guy actually did torpor or not. Uh, but yeah, let me take the uh, the thing back to base here. Also... Oh, yeah. Let's... Here, let's... Uh, here, come here. What's up, man? What's up, man? <laughs> dude, he attacks so fast. This guy is actually really, really good. This is crazy how good he is. And now that we have a dung beetle, I wonder if he can breed him. It'd be cool if you could breed them. Let's see, are you are you a male or female? I don't I mean I don't think it really matters. No, NA, okay. So I want to make good the perfect dung beetle baby. That's what we need to do. Okay, guys, so I've been exploring on uh, the beetle here for a while. I haven't really found anything, and I think it's because he's so slow. Uh, but anyways, I end up killing a lot of stuff. We have, let's see, uh, about a hundred more arrow or darts, which is good. Uh, we got a lot of kibble and some other things as well. I've mostly been transferring all the stuff to my main inventory here. Uh, should we put this on top of that? Sure, we'll just put this on top of that. I'm not sure why. Uh, can I do? Yeah, darts. Okay, perfect. Anyways, also we have a couple more long neck rifles just from scavenging. Actually, we got another one right there. Nice. So we got four. We got plenty. Um, and then I guess that's pretty much it. We got some spoiled meat. This guy is really good as a tank. Now, I was reading through the patch notes, and apparently he used to be able to mine stone. I still think he should. I mean, look at this giant-ass hardened head. He should be able to mine stone or something. I think that'd be pretty good. Uh, but yeah, he's definitely really cool. I like this uh, giant beetle a lot. One thing I want to do is let's stick him on Wondering. And I'm curious how fast he'll actually make oil and fertilizer. This actually might be a good way instead of doing it the traditional way. Just using this dude or maybe a bunch of these dudes. 
I don't know how fast he'll do it though. Is he is he like he's like on top of that thing? Why why are you why are you on top of that thing, dude? Uh get off of that. That you're not supposed to be up there, man. <laughs> he just he's like I the the Parasaur is my new home. Uh let's have you made anything yet? No, you haven't made anything. Okay, well I guess we'll leave you in here wandering for a while. Hopefully you can't get over like the wall somehow by like coming up here. And then we'll see how good he actually does. We might end up making a large beetle enclosure, though. But I think we're going to take the uh, the Firebird out again. And uh, maybe try to find some more stuff. Oh, guys, look, there's an Alpha Bronto over here. I was thinking maybe we should try to kill this dude for all the sweet loots. Uh, I need to really go around and start killing Alphas. Uh, let's just... Oh, my God. That is... Ab oh, my God. Is he going to do... Oh, my God. I'm doing so much more damage, I feel like. Dude, look at that damage. That's crazy. That's so good. Now, the, the, the cool thing about this guy compared to the stupid... Are you... Here, I'm, we're just gonna... We're just gonna get some stamina back here. Uh, but, yeah, he doesn't actually summon in minions and all that crap. So, I don't have to really worry about it. But we're doing... We're doing thousands of damage here. Did the... I feel like the Firebird got buffed or something. Because there was no way. There was absolutely no way we did this much damage before. This is a crazy amount of damage. This is an absolutely nuts amount of damage. Anyway, so let's kill this dude. I'm going to see what he has in inventory. And then I guess we're going to harvest his body with uh, a hatchet or something. There we go, baby. We just murdered the crap out of him. Uh, let's get out the hatchet and let's see how good of a loot he actually gives us. Okay. Lot prime blood. What is prime blood used for? Okay, that has to be new, I think. Lots of prime hide. A lot of prime blood. Okay, that's all good. Dude, this is giving us so much stuff, guys. So, okay, so 1,500. And then what do you have in your inventory? Please be a lot of cool stuff. Okay, so uncommon trank pikes. That's good. Uh, a rare flak helmet. I will take that. Uh, we will take two, two amethysts, two huge experience potions, black pearls. And you know what? We'll go ahead and take all of the ammo as well. And I guess we might as well take the guns. And that's pretty good right there, actually. Uh, we don't need any of these. GPS. No, nah, we don't need any of that. But yeah, that's pretty good, man. Uh, so I think I'm going to actually go around and try to find and kill some alphas. And then we're going to continue looking around for some other creatures to tame. I really want the theory. Or there's a new Prime Trudon that apparently gives you a lot of experience. So I want to see if we can get that as well, maybe, possibly. Uh, so there's a Prime. What's with the, all the Jerboas and everything that I play only be level one? I don't understand why Jerboas are level one, but there's a prime Jerbo. Can we ride these guys? Wait, wait, wait. I'm, I'm your friend, buddy. No, 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 no. I'm your, uh, okay. You know, you want to play this game? I'm just going to murder you then. I was going to like keep you as a friend, you know, maybe possibly passive tame you. But now that you dude, he's so fast. I wonder if you can ride them. Dude, that'd be so cool if you could like ride them and bounce around and stuff. Like, I wonder if they can bounce really high. Hmm, I don't even know if they're tameable. Maybe I should look up if they're tameable real quick. Well, guys, I was going to tame this Jerboa, but I tried to give it its preferred food. It's herbivore baby food. And uh, the guide also says I need to knock him out. And I need to feed him uh, herbivore baby food. And uh, it didn't do anything. So I just wasted like three video clips of trying to figure out how to tame this dude. And nothing worked. So there's no way to tame Jerboas as far as I know right now. Uh, they do not eat herbivore baby food. They do not eat berries. They do not any, eat any sort of kibble. I gave them like 40 different types of kibble. Um, and the guide says herbivore baby food, so I don't I'm missing something either that or he's not fully in right now Okay guys are back. So I've been looking around for alphas for maybe about an hour now. I've killed like one or two I haven't really found that many um, And it looks like they've actually reduced the price of the helmets back to one so that's pretty good. So we just need a ruby. We have like four or five of each of them. And we just need a bunch of keratin. But I can't, or keratin or chitin. But I can't find anything like any alphas to kill that has, that actually drops keratin or chitin. Uh, so we're kind of SOL with that. And also I haven't got any rubies yet. So alphas are just rare on the volcano, I feel like. I mean, I always search for hours. And I could just really never find any. Um, as for theory and all that kind of stuff, I didn't find any of that. But what I, one thing I wanted to do though, before we end the episode here is I wanted to maybe make, so this is a Bronto. This is a Giga. That's pretty good. Uh, let's see. Megatherium, T-Rex, uh, let's see, Stego. And then let's do, there's a theory actually. Uh, let's do a Giga, I think. And then let's do a theory. And then I'm just curious about all of these really. Uh, the, now, I think these act as refrigerators. I'm not exactly sure. Let's go and do that, uh, which is, that was good for experience. How big are they? Okay, so they just have, like, little babies in them. Okay, that's interesting. Uh, you could probably make, it like, a cool-looking lab with this. Uh, I'm going to stick this, like, right here, possibly. So it's like an infant baby, and then it's just a refrigerator. Okay, 
and it's powered. So that's pretty cool. So we got refrigerators now. Actually, let me uh, pick this guy up. I'm going to stick, even though we don't really need this many refrigerators, I'm just going to stick these dudes like in the corner over here. And then uh, it'll just be kind of like refrigerators and also for decoration, possibly. And I'm going to stick this dude like right there. Boom. And then we shall stick uh, the other one right here. I really like the tech mod or the, uh, the Ecos tech mod. Okay, so we got the theory. Dude, look at that. It looks so good. Uh, and then, yeah, it looks like they're incubating, kind of. And then we got a... a What what was this? Was What was this? I thought I built a T-Rex. Maybe it was a Megalosaurus or something? I don't know what I built. That's something. And then we got the Giga right here. Okay, so awesome. We got all three of these. Can they do anything special? Let's see. Axe inventory, set pin code. No, it looks like that's about it. Uh, and they all have the same slots, too. Yeah, these are definitely really, really awesome. Anyways, guys, I think I'm going to go ahead and call it there. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to smash the like button. I'd really appreciate it. It helped me out tremendously. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Also, names for the Alpha Dilo and also names for the Prime Dung. Now, the Prime Dung has been doing some stuff for a while. I think he has... Uh, he's done one. Uh, yeah, we got some fertilizer, which is good, and we got some oil. So, yeah, this guy is just going to make um, all the stuff that we need. So, we pretty much have unlimited fertilizer at this point. Uh, we just need to really get into uh, growing crops and everything else.